good morning. It's raining. I'm leaving um, one hour after scheduled time. So, New York it is. So I'm entering the George Washington Bridge here um, in, in New York, Manhattan. And this is cool because I have the easy pass. I don't know how many thousands, hundreds of thousands, and maybe millions of cars pass through each day. And it's just amazing how smooth everything goes. This is the main, main uh, line that goes along the coast, uh, the 95 the main freeway. There's always so much traffic. I'm actually very lucky. This is light traffic today. Um, it, the rain is not as heavy anymore, so this is fun. But unfortunately, if it was sunny, um, you could see Manhattan. It's actually to my right, but it's it's not. It's raining. Oh well. Okay, so I just drove through um, the upper side of Manhattan and even though it's light traffic, it was still, it was still an experience and I just love, I love to remember all the good times um, I lived when I lived in Manhattan, but I'm glad, I'm grateful that I have my lavender and I can just breathe, um, get, you know, back to the centered peace, calm place. I'm tired a little bit today um, and you know there's a lot of things we have to take care of and it's very difficult to be here and try to coordinate things at home and and it's very hard when when you know Matthew and I have a hard time communicating that's just the hard part of any relationship marriage and life but we have to try our best and I think I think what it is is just really leaning into trust and love and knowing that you know seeing the intention behind what we're trying to communicate to each other rather than always just getting stuck on the surface like what's um, the, the things that we're you know we all deal with I just passed the Jones Beach where um, there are summer concerts a great stage for summer concerts I saw several concerts there um, just great memories when I lived in Manhattan five years between 92 and 97 I just stopped for a minute at the uh, beach I'm here I got here half an hour early to check my email in the car kind of like car office I was looking for uh, you know a coffee shop but I couldn't see I didn't see one you know just to check my email check the Facebook do some work and take a breath and I'm gonna take you to the ocean now This is the Atlantic Ocean, Mastic Beach. It's kind of cold. There's my little car. This is a little tiny town on Long Island. This is probably the old church. We might be here tonight, I'm not sure. But I thought it was cute, this little church and then the big tower behind it. I just had a really nice dinner, long dinner with, with 
two priests here. One, um, Father Brian, has an amazing story. He was ordained late in life and lived kind of like a monastic life while doing all kinds of odd jobs. And, and what I love, where I uh, connected with him was Thomas Moore, uh, Merton. Yes, yes, yes. So I think it's going to be good tonight. Just look how cute it is. Yeah, beautiful church. It was built in uh, 2000. Can I, can, I, can I show you first? Yeah. To my friends? Oh, yeah, sure. This is Father Ryan. Hello, hello. Looking forward to tonight. Yeah. Tanchi's going to be great. The, the people, the, the parking lot's filled up, so it's going to be a wonderful night. Yeah. You have but, an amazing story, too. Oh, uh, yeah, well, that's um, that's how it is with uh, we take our faith into, um, you know, start living it, you know, surrounding yeah. ourselves. It always takes care of us. Ah, I love what I, you just did, opening your arms. That's how I feel like I just want to walk. Here, you take a picture of me. Yes. I just want to walk like this the entire life. Just to be open. Yeah, beautiful. <laughs> but I would kind of look silly. <laughs> the parish of St. Jude's loved your performance and your meditation. Everybody was thrilled. I, my little 12-year-old student said it was very spiritual and he thought you had a beautiful voice. So thank you very much, much Tatiana. Okay, I'm officially tired. It's uh, it's not that late, but we just finished, and it was a good day, another long day. I can't even get out of my jacket. I just, <laughs> I just, um, I have to take my makeup off, of course. But um, yeah, I just wanted to finish this day up and tell you how much I appreciate you who are watching and. Um, just kind of journeying with me, um, allowing me to inspire you. I got a really nice um, message from a singer-songwriter from originally from Croatia, Romania, and now living in Austria. It sounds like Christiana, I think it's pronounced Uikaza, and just very inspiring. Just, just, this is, I love it. You know, I love how um, we're able to inspire each other and empower each other and encourage each other and knowing that we're all in this together and why not support each other? Why not all together make this world a little bit better place? Bring hope. There's so much, so much hurt. There's so much healing needed in our world. And, you know, love and, and what we're trying to do crosses crosses all borders, crosses religions. It has to. It really have to. It has to. So, thank you. I'll sleep in in the morning. I don't have to drive far tomorrow, so it's going to be another good day. Thank you. <laughs>